Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be covering uh, a couple of fixes for the connection for this site is not secure on Edge. So let's get right into it. Edge is the integrated search or web browser for Windows devices and it is the successor, su successor for Windows Explorer or Internet Explorer. Uh, now, uh, you might have this not secure message uh, which uh, basically means the website is running on HTTP instead of HTTPS, uh, the latter being the secure HTTP version, and it just might interfere or uh, infect your br uh, browser or your computer with some things if you're not careful on which sites you're entering. If you do not trust a site and it's, it is not secure, just exit out of it and do not use it. Uh, but yeah, you can... Uh, fix this in a couple of ways. You can use Microsoft Edge with HTTPS only uh, by opening Microsoft Edge and follow, entering the following URL flag in the addresses bar, and that's basically what the uh, URL is. Uh, then the automatic HTTPS flag will be highlighted. Uh, as you can see here, click the drop down menu and select enabled, and now you will be asked to restart, and once you restart, you'll, you'll only be able to use HTTPS sites. Uh, then in the in private window, which is basically just incognito mode, uh, you will be secure pretty much, uh, and you don't need to worry about HTTPS not working properly. Uh, as I said, this is the same as uh, Chrome's incognito mode, so you can just use that. You can also adjust the date and time on your device that might interfere uh, with it if, it's not, if it is not accurate. And those are just some other fixes uh, along the basic ones, such as restarting Microsoft Edge, checking your uh, connection, clearing your cache, and so on and so forth. And that is basically all there is to it. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be seeing you guys next time.